Okay, so this is what we call a tripod. Oh. And I'm gonna put you behind the camera and you actually get to boss me around. How about oh. that? Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> <I'll do that. laughs> As you're cleaning out your flower beds, you really need to get down in there and get out some of these leaves. You might find these little spikes sticking out of the ground and wonder, what is that? Well, if you aren't familiar with your garden, you don't remember it from last year, this is the beginning of what a hosta looks like. They look like little spikes, and when they come out of the ground, they're really grown for their foliage. Not for these spiky little flowers, but they're grown for the beautiful big leaves that form once they're full grown. So this is really the best time to move them. So as I'm cleaning out the garden, this area looks way overgrown. There are a few little clusters of hosta, and guess what? We can move some of these around, and I'll show you how. <laughs> Take them flowers, huh, <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so I'm looking at different clusters here in this hosta. Where do you dig first, right? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> you yeah, can't yeah. make comments, Dad. Am I in it? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so the first thing I'm looking for is I'm looking for these different clusters of hosta plants. So there's a big cluster here, and it almost comes out for the middle and fans out. That means there's a big crown right there. There's a small cluster up against these rocks, and there's a bigger cluster back here and a couple more. So the big point is you want to grab a cluster all by itself. That way you can transplant that little cluster somewhere else in the yard. And we're doing it right now where they're very young. It's easy to transport, and we're going to give this hosta a little bit more room. That's another big thing. They get too crowded. These kind of plants grow very well in Southeast Michigan and Northwest Ohio. And so they get a little bit packed in there. And when they have more room to spread out, they're even prettier. So you can see these are very packed in. We're going to get rid of some of these and give them a little bit of room. I'll show you how. <laughs> the only tool we really need is a sharp shovel. So I'm going to pick out one of these areas. Like I told you, that cluster, I'm going to dig as deep as I can, dig around these hosta plants. You want to make sure that you grab as much soil as possible. Just pop them out of the ground. Just like that. So in this one spot alone, we have quite a few hosts to start. Look at that. I have one, two, three, four, five just in this little cluster. We've got dozens in this one. And we'll probably break this. So this goes more locations around the yard. Here's another little cluster, but you can see six or seven in there. Even more over here. And look, I want to keep all of that soil along with it. Oh, and this one back here. Whew. Now we're ready to replant this hosta somewhere else in the garden. Now you get out there and get growing. <laughs>